Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is about how to custom a Windows to install in VPS server on DigitalOcean. Well, we must create a Windows by ourselves because when we download it from Google, sometimes the Windows is contain virus, keylogger, so we would like to create a Windows by ourselves. Uh, the Windows I use is originally from Microsoft Windows Server 2016-2019-2020 uh, For Windows 10 and Windows 11, I use Windows from Cospectry and one Windows 10 21H2 uh, Windows from Microsoft and let's start. Open your digital ocean, then create a droplet. For me, I use Singapore region, it's up to you, data center, then OS, operation system, you must choose Ubuntu and the version, the easiest version is 20. Then for CPU options, I choose regular for 8 GB RAM. Then authentication method, I use password. Create your password. Then hostname is, okay, I give one. It's up to you. Click create droplet. You just wait until it's finished. After you finish, you just copy the IP, then open putty or bitfiles. Here I will, I'm going to use bitfiles. So we pass the, this here and login. Then accept for this connection. Enter your password that you created in the past, then OK. Click new terminal console. Then we start from here. First, download and install the installer file. Just copy. Then paste here. By right click, then enter. Grant execution permission to the file. Just click. Right click, enter. Run the installer. Right click, enter. You just wait the installer, download the Windows, and download the Virtio. If you don't have time to create a, to custom a Windows, you can use my Windows in the description below. If you find this one, you just enter. You just click enter on your keyboard. Then you will find this one. You must choose one of the windows with uh, that you want to custom. Today, I want to custom this uh, the six windows, the Windows 10 21 H2. So I type six and enter. After Windows download is complete, now we run KMU. Just copy. You should open Notepad before. Don't forget to change the XX1 with a type of Windows. It's like 10. It's like this. It's 10, 20, H2. 21, H2. Okay. If you're ready. So we copy, then we pass here and enter twice. Enter twice. After this, you open Real VNC Viewer, then copy the IP, pass on VNC, and enter. Click Continue. The installation is started. If you don't have time to create a custom windows like this, you can use my windows on the descriptions below. Just buy me a coffee. Then just click next, then install now, and setup is starting. 
Just click I don't have a product key. Then for this, I choose Windows 10 Pro. Windows 10 Pro, click next. Then I accept the license terms, click next. Click custom in install Windows only. Then click load driver, click browse, then find a Virtio. This one in E, then click AMD 64, then find W10, W10, because we use Windows 10. Click OK, then click Next. You find this one, just click Next. Then you just wait this. After finishing up, it will be restarted like this. And what you do is just waiting. Once again, if you don't have time to create a custom Windows like this, you can use my Windows in the description below. Just buy me a coffee. Then you choose the region. Just click yes. And in this, in this step, I click Shift and F10 to CMD. Yes, you just come to CMD and I will cut the internet by type in cpa.cpl. Yes, we are going to disconnect this internet. Just right click and disable this internet. Close it. Close, then this is closed. Then we just wait. Why the internet must be disabled? Because when you are go on with, with internet, the windows will start to update and it will make it harder and harder so your custom windows can be failed will you find this just click skip just wait until you find this one just click i don't have internet in the corner then just click continue with limited setup this name will become your username on RDP, on VBS, on Windows VBS. Just click next. I don't want to use a password, so I leave it blank. Just click next. Then you can just click accept. For Cortana, I choose not now. Your Windows will be ready. Now you have a Windows. But the first time you have to do is just come to File Explorer, then click this PC, then click Drive Virtio. You just copy all of this, copy, come to Drive C, must create a folder, I name it Virtio, then I pass all of Virtio driver here. Just enable remote desktop. After finish, type in the search section here remote just find remote desktop setting enable it on then confirm then find sleep power and sleep setting from 10 minutes to never type local security local security policy just click click local policy just security option this one click twice Limit local account use of blank password. Click disable. Then apply. Then OK. You have already done for customer windows. So you can close it. Close VNC. Then we will compress the Windows Server file. Just click 20H2. For Kemu, you just click Ctrl C T R L N C. Yes, the Kemu is terminating on sign out too. Then pass this one and enter. The progress is invisible, but this is progresses. This is progressing. So you have to wait. Okay, it's already finished. So now 
we install Apache just click this one then type Y then allow firewall access right click enter then this one move the gz to html copy don't forget to change the x one like this yeah was set to h2 okay enter this the progress is invisible but this is progressing it's already done now you can try now you are finished you are finished you can close it then you just copy this one you will get your windows like this so uh, it's like H2 then okay this is your windows is here we can we can test it by access it just click enter and you can get it ah, this one now we will install it on our digital ocean just click on backup and snapshot click custom image here you click import via URL and pass here then click next then for distribution you choose unknown one and the region is up to you I choose Singapore is nearest from my country just click upload image then we have to wait for about five hours our video is finished today we will continue in the next video in the second video how to install this windows to our vps thank you very much bye bye